Okay, I'm reviewing the RK9 Black Dog No Bark Collar. And I was going to do this on Tide. And the other day he started limping. And he hasn't felt the best. It's just kind of his arthritis is acting up. And also, because he is a Basset Hound, the folds under his neck do not want to cooperate too well with this. And we did put it on him. And uh, he's... Somehow my husband had actually turned it up a little too much. And that's how you turn it up. And eh, he didn't like it. And he was getting excited about going outside and barking. And that's just something that, that he and my husband do together. So we had to take it off of him. It does work. I will say that it does work. It's just tight. It's just not feeling good. And we didn't want to sit here and try to put him through the video. And I needed to go ahead and get this review out. I wish I could have done it. But... He's still not trained with it. It does take time <clears throat> to work with them over time. But let me tell you a little bit about it and I will get to that. Alright. This is, it sends a safe little shock to it. And I put these on there. It comes with these two little tiny ones. And it says that there is a manual that's included in video and I eventually found it it does not come in the box um I did eventually find it and I did finally get my email to it and nowhere in there does it explain about changing these the ones that they had were the ones that were already on there so I'm not sure what that was about so I don't know which works better for what with these little ones on that I had no information on that <clears throat> but it does work and I'm going to try to sit here and blow and do the video oh I think I turned it off no 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 I didn't okay I'm supposed to give it a little blow so you can hear how loud it is and the little light comes on and there's different steps and this is the tester that comes with it so it lights up when you blow into it so let me try to blow again Ah, that's a really bad video. Sorry. And yeah, it's just not going to do it. I'm not going to be able to do it with one hand. And everybody is busy right now to help me. But you put the little tester on the prongs and it lets you know if it's sending a little shock. And it does it in steps. And I, it says to get it on there extremely tight where you can only get one finger in there. And I have tiny fingers. And Bo was able to get just one finger in there. And still when Tide shook his neck, I guess it's the Basset Hound Rolls, it would go off and shock him. And he didn't like that. Um, I wish that they would have just included a manual and instructions in the box along with it. Rather than having to look it up online. And my thing I do not like is that it tells me nothing about these. Um, it's... This one's in black. You can get them in different colors. Different colors represent like different weights. The black represents um, dogs. It says one thing. It says 15 to 120 pounds on Amazon. Then when you look down it says 4 to 100 pounds. So I'm not sure on that one. But it is for a bigger dog. And it is safe. And I'm not going to say hey it's not. You get an extra battery with it. Um... <clears throat> I just think probably because he did not feel well that he really didn't like it but it does work we did notice it does work it's just he he's still he's still feeling under the weather but he's starting to feel better and so he was excited and yeah it does do it and with some training once he gets feeling better we are going to continue to try to use this because tide has a problem at barking at every single thing if the children take him outside and we put him on his lead he barks constantly at every person or thing that walks by and it's very annoying and he has such a loud bark but there you can there's nine different color choices that you can get um there's some that do like a vibration there's some just shock i believe and um this one i said is the the no bark it does send a little slight shock after the beep and sometimes it'll send like four little shocks. I'm not sure exactly how. I don't have that written down right beside me because it's on the manual on my computer. But it's $24.95, which is not a bad problem. I mean, I really like that because most training collars are outrageous and this is a really good price. 
um i do like it and we're going to continue to work with it on tide just like i said just i was not going to put my dog through it and i needed to get this video review out and he's just not been because of the cold weather his he's been limping a little bit because his arthritis flared up and i just i couldn't have the heart to put it he's my child okay sorry <laughs> i really wanted to and i will in my pictures take a picture of him wearing it though i do have one of those so that's it for the review guys i want to put that um the uh, rk9 did send this to me for my unbiased and honest review and i do like it i'm not hating on it at all it's just tied sick I really like it. It does work because we did notice it was working. He kind of gives us a strange look after, if when he got really barky barky and like what's going on. <laughs> so you do, after they do it, you're supposed to tell them no to stop them from barking. I do that, re read that on the um, instructions. <clears throat> so that's it guys and if you want, I will leave the product, well if you want, I'm going to do it anyway. <laughs> I'm going to leave the product a link down at the bottom of this review. Thanks, guys.